Hello, my friends, and thank you for tuning in. This is CT Craftstastic, and we are in day six, day six of, oh, I make sure you guys can see that, of the 10 day, 10 days of surprise. And uh, this is the 68 surprise strategy, day six. Uh, if you've been following along, we've been up a couple times, we've been down a couple times. Uh, the first day we, we were down uh, half of our bankroll. The uh, rest of the days we've been very close or up. So I'm liking the way the strategy is playing out. But as I promised, we're going to go ahead and hit it again. Ten days of surprise. And if you would please, while we're getting set up, there's $75 on the don't pass. Do me a favor if you would please. The biggest thing that, that could happen for me is you hit the thumbs up for a like and click on subscribe. If you haven't subscribed, thank you to all those of you who have. I'm super grateful for each and every one of you, but I'm really trying to uh, to get up to that thousand subscriber level, and it's going to be a long haul. I understand that, but I sure appreciate the people who uh, who do click on subscribe to my channel. If there's anything I can do for you, you let me know, and I'm happy to, to reciprocate. In the meantime, uh, just wanted to recap what we're doing here with the, the 68 surprise. I'll uh, put a link to the original 68 Surprise, which was a breakout video for me, performed like five times better than any of the other videos that I've put out. And so I, I put a link to that for you if you'd like to see down in the description below. More to the point, the strategy I think has teeth. I'm playing with a $300 bankroll. I should be playing with a $750 to $1,000 bankroll. I get it. But I'm going to try to be sensitive to your time, and I want to make sure that uh, you know we just kind of get the most bang for our buck in a short period of time. So $75 unprotected on the uh, don't pass. True story. I went to a casino one time, and I was playing a different strategy, and I literally lost $300 because I rolled five sevens and two elevens, just like that. I mean, it was it was ridiculous how fast. That could happen on this because it's an unprotected, don't pass strategy. So far, so good, but I want you to know it can and does happen when you roll back-to-back -back sevens, and uh, that'll kill your strategies. Could be the shortest video I ever make. Here we go. Coming out. And it looks good today. I say that with uh, bated breath. Aces are going to pay us $75 Oops. on that... Uh, don't pass line. Always love it when that happens. It doesn't happen all the time, and often it goes right away as soon as you, you, you collect it. So let's see how we do. Coming up. And there it is, a nine. It's worked out for us today. Point is nine. I'm going to put $30 on each of the six and the eight. The system is simple, guys. You press three times, one unit press each of the three times, and then you collect three times, and then you regress down to the original bet. So our point is nine. We've got $30 on the six and the eight. If we hit a seven, we're up $15 because of the $75 don't pass. All we got to do is avoid the nine while we're trying to build our stacks. Here we go. There's the eight. It's going to pay us $35. There's $35. We'll go ahead and press one, pocket the five. Two more hits, guys, two more hits. And it's not to be, there's a seven, big red. I'm not too worried about it because my original investment was $60. And I'm gonna get made, I'm gonna get paid 75 for it. Yes, did I lose that $35 that we want? It's true, it's true. But the strategy is to build up to three hits, three presses, and then collect. Okay? It seems to work pretty well for the most uh, most time that I'm playing it. We're going to find out if it does or doesn't in this video. This is day six of the 10 days of surprise. There we go. There's a 10. That's the best possible between 10 and 4. Best possible scenario for this strategy. Because it's easier to hit a 6 and an 8 than it is a 10 by a lot. 7 doesn't hurt us. Dice out. And there's a 9.
Ace of Ducey. Not going to help, not going to hurt. And seven out. Seven out. Okay, there's $75 on that don't pass line. $15 gain. Kind of a grind at that point. Coming up. And there's the eight. I do play the same strategy, whether it's the six or the eight, which is the point. I realize that that negates the value of one of these, at least at this point in the, the process, it negates the value of the eight. However, it also mitigates the sting of hitting the point and losing $75. I'll make 35, I'll lose 75. Okay? All right, dice out. And there's the eight. There it is right there, just as we described it. I'm gonna make 35, I'm gonna lose 75. But watch what I do with this, guys. I'm still going to press. I'm going to press that 8, bank that, drop another 75, hope for a 4 or a 10. 5 or a 9, that'd be all right, too. But really hope for that 4 or 10 as we come out. Here we go. And there's the AC-DC. Thank everything that is happy because there's another $75 in our account. Coming out, and there's a five, four, one, five. That's our new point. These are on now. These, they were off while we were coming out, guys. I should have clarified that. We've got $60 on the eight. We've got $30 on the six. We need two more hits that we're going to press, and then we're going to start to collect. There is a 10, easy. And we've got another 10, easy. And seven out, just like that, guys. For the shooter, we make $15. Yeah, we, we have to toss away a little bit of the the, the profits of the shot that we just uh, made on the eight, but for the shooter, we're up fifteen dollars. Fifteen dollars. If you did this, let's let's say you, you rolled four shoot, you know, went through four shooters or four points in uh, in an hour. Fifteen bucks uh, times four, sixty bucks an hour. I'm sorry, uh, yeah, fifteen dollars times four, sixty bucks a uh, an hour. It's a decent wage, guys. That's a decent wage. Okay? Not always going to work out. It's obviously the game of crafts. We could uh, we could lose it all. It's true. But so far, so good. Started with a $300 bankroll. Feeling good about where we're at right now. AC Ducey. That's another $75 winner on the Don't Pass. Can't count on it, folks. You cannot count on that to be the case. Well, you take it when you get it. Coming out. And there's a seven. What is the saying? The good Lord giveth, and the good Lord taketh away. There we go. Coming out. Four, one, five. That's our new point. Did I sell? Oh, before I do that, let's go ahead and put our bets down. Dice it up. We got a five, six, yo. And there's an eight that's going to pay us 35. So we'll go ahead and press. It's one press. We need two more. Part 10. Boxcars. There's the eight again. It's going to pay us $70 this time. 
60 down there, it's going to be 70. I'm going to go ahead and press one unit. Now we got 90. I'm going to go ahead and collect the difference. One more, guys. One more hit. And we're good to go. Here we go. 6, 4, 10. Dice out. Oh, ugly. Ugly, ugly. Another 6, 4, 10. Sorry, guys. All right, we're looking for one more hit on the 6 of the 8 before we hit the, uh, before we hit anything, the 7 or the, the, the point. But uh, loving where this is going so far. Dice out. And there's a 6, 3, 9. Dice out. 415, that's our point. We're going to lose that $75, guys. Keep in mind, though, this is not the end of the world as we know it. Because these are still going to stay on the board. They're off right now. I got 90 on the 8, right? And I got 30 on the 6. So I like where we're standing. They're off right now. We put another $75 down. But we're in position to getting teed up for a big roll. And AC Ducey on the come out. Thank you, thank you, thank you. There it is. We're in a good place, guys. I'm telling you, we're in a good place. Start off with a $300 bankroll. We are in a good place. Here we go. Coming up. And there's the eight. All right? Not going to be our favorite. However, however, still going to be a winner now because of the way that we played this. There's $90 on that eight. Okay? So if we hit the eight, we make 105. We lose the point of 75. We make 105. By my count, that's a win of $30. Okay? So what we're shooting for now is the six and see if we can't start to collect a little bit at a time. All right? There we go. Dice up. And we got the six. That's good. This is our first collect. Uh, I'm sorry. This is our last press. So that makes 35. Press. And now we're hoping to hit that six a bunch of times when we start to collect. Here we go. There's four. Day six of the ten days of surprise. There is a six right there. That six is paying sitting sixty. We're gonna pay seventy. And we collect it all. That's collection number one. We're going to collect two more times and then revert down, regress down to the original $30.6, $30.8. Nice up. And there's the eight now. Yes, we hit the point. Okay? Hit the point. That eight. We're going to lose the 75, but that 8 is going to pay us 105, okay? Pays us 105. We'll go ahead and rack that. Put $75 down again. Look at where we're at, guys. We're in a great place because these are in position right now. Let's see, was that, uh, was that our third hit? No, that's only our second hit. We're in good place here, guys. So we're going to leave those off. We're going to roll out for the 75. And hopefully we hit a 4 or a 10. We'll take the 5 or 9, but we'll hopefully hit a 4 or a 10 and get us a few good hits. Actually, one more good hit on this, and then we're going to regress down to the original bet. Hoping that makes sense to you. If it makes sense to you, go ahead and give a thumbs up. Give me a like on the, uh, on the video, would you? All right, so we're coming out unprotected on the 75. And there's the 8. All right. 
So we're back on the eight. We're still in the same position as we were before. But I mean, we could do this all day long, guys. If we hit the point, we make thirty dollars because we're going to make one hundred and five here and lose seventy five here. If we hit the six, we're going to make seventy dollars. So no matter what we do here, we're going to be good. And there's no downside. The only downside, if you want to call it a downside, is we've got this uh, situation where, um, you, you know, if, if we hit a seven, we're going to make $75. We're going to lose all that's here. And there are people I know who will sit there and say, yeah, and that was your money. That was your profits. Uh, and other people hate when they say it's house money. I don't care about any of that. Because the original bet, 75, against the original bet, 60, it's a $15 win. Okay. Now, if you hit the point unprotected out here and lose the $75, or if you roll the 7 like we did, we're in a situation. right? But right now, I could stop right now and be way up. Way up. So let's just keep playing it out, see how it goes. 8's our new point. We've got two more collections to happen before we regress. Here we go. So 415. There's the 7. All right. Maybe talking about it jinxed us. I'm okay with it. Going to make 75 on that. Guys, I could stop right now and be way ahead. I'm gonna play one more round, one more, one more shooter, and see where we go with it. I'm hoping you're digging it. This is day six of the 10 days of surprise. 68 surprise. Here we go. Coming up. Dice off the table. That's no roll. There we go, coming up. And we got a six. Hard six is the point. If there's a weak spot in the strategy beyond the come out, this is it when we've got one of our numbers. However, it mitigates the loss. You know, when you're when you're making $35 and losing $70, it doesn't hurt as much. Does that make sense? All right. Here we go, dice out. It's our last shooter. Five, four, nine. Three, two, five. And seven out. All right, guys. We lose that 60, we're going to make 75. And we're going to count it up. I mean, it's just, it's just that simple, guys. And it's not a complicated. Uh, I'm not a genius. I'm not a rocket scientist. I don't pretend to be one on TV. But I know how to count winnings. Start off with a $300 bankroll. There's our $300. All right, guys, so there's a $300 original bankroll. We've got 100, 200, 50, 75, 300, $310. And what was that, 15, 20 minutes? Now, guys, again, I'm not a rocket scientist. I'm not a genius. But I know that's a good day. That's a good day, guys. And, and you know, you can play it however you want. We played low roller. We played uh, the, the regular way. I hope you've enjoyed it. I hope you've had a good time. This is day six of our 10 days of surprise. I'm CT Crabstastic. I want to say thank you so much for taking the time. If you made it all the way to the end of this video, do me a favor. If you haven't yet, subscribe. Subscribe to the channel. And uh, if you haven't uh, clicked the notification bell, click that. And I, hope for, uh, I look forward to seeing you again for day seven of the 10 days of surprise. Have a great day.